Hello children. Welcome back to your maths class. Today we will continue with the same topic division and today's topic is long division using multiplication tables. So let us start. Question is given to you divide. We have to divide 25 by 5. So in long division how we will divide 25 by 5? For that we have done division and there you have used multiplication table. So here also for solving this question we will use multiplication table. So we know 5 table. So here I am going to write the table of 5. So 5 ones are 5 5 twos are 10 5 threes are 15 5 fours are 20 5 fives are we get 25 and here we have also 25 so 5 table how many times we read 5 times so for division we will use this 5 we will read 5 times and got answer 25 so now how we will do the division here we will write and how to write for long division here and we will draw like this and next like this okay now what is given to you 25 like this and children in previous video you have learned this one we call divisor this one dividend so if we divide 25 by 5 we will use how many times 5 times so here I am going to write 5 5 times I got 25 5 5 sir 25 and now we will do the subtraction so 5 minus 5 we got 0 so we are going to write here 0. Now 2 minus 2 we got again 0. So like this. Now what we call this one? This one I told divisor. This one I told dividend. And this one quotient. So what we call this one? So after subtraction nothing is left. So this one we call remainder. Okay? What we call it? Remainder. And remember one thing that when we are going to divide these things, always give the subtraction sign here. And this is the process to do the long division. So what I call? This one I call. Here I am going to write. Dividend. This one I have told. Divisor and this one I said function and this zero I said remainder. Okay, no, now how to write all these things after doing the division. This one I said divisor, big digit, which one we are going to divide, we call it as a dividend and how many times we will use the table, that number we call quotient and after subtraction, what we get, that one we call remainder. Now, after sub doing the division, we are going to mention all the things by writing it below, okay? 
children you can see i have erased the table and the arrow marking which i have shown so when it has been asked to divide any digit first thing you will divide it by using multiplication table okay and next thing you have to write the dividend divisor quotient and remainder so how to write it after doing the division you can write it here first dividend d i v i d e n d dividend means the bigger spelling we can remember that the biggest digit we have to use so dividend is 25 next after dividend we are going to write about the divisor so divisor is 5 now this one quotient q u o t i e n t quotient is what we get 5 and the last part that is we have to write the remainder means what is remaining so what we get after sub division we get zero so in place of 20 i am going to write only 1020 means 10 okay children so like this let us see number 2 question now children you can see number 2 is 42 divided by 7 so what i told first we have to do the long division so for that here bigger number that is 42 and here is the divisor and here is the dividend now we are going to read the table of 7 but no need to write it here okay for your convenient i have in question number 1 shown the table but now we are going to read the table of 7 and we will check that in how many times we will get the number 42 so 7 ones is 7 7 2 0 14 7 3 0 21 7 4 0 28 7 5 0 35 7 6 0 42 so how many times we read the table of 7 6 times so we will write here 6 and in 6 time what we get we get the answer 42 Here always subtraction sign. Now we will subtract two minus two zero four minus four zero. Okay. Now next part is to write all the things what we get. So here I get first thing that is dividend is forty two. Next divisor is seven. After that quotient, what we get six, and now last part is remainder. We get zero. Okay, so children like this. we will solve long division what i have told here divisor in between dividend we will read the table of 7 how many times we will got that digit we will write here we will do the subtraction and we will get the remainder after that we have to write all the things and one more thing you can write here after division what you get okay so what you get after division Six, six times we get forty-two. So this thing also you can write. So like these children, you can solve more three question which will be given in your homework. Now note down your homework. Divide using long division. So write down all the question in your max copy and solve it. So that's all for today's class. Bye bye children